Today I'm going to show you a simple trick to draw better curve, to make it smoother. You will see, you will love it because it's so simple. So let me first of all hide the background so we can see better the curve. And let's add a Bezier curve. So we have this and I want to change the pattern, the design. So let's go to edit mode. Let's delete everything. And let's use, for example, the pencil because I want to create my own pattern. So maybe I want to do something like that. Something like this. I'm trying to do it the best I can. And now I come back to object mode. And as you can see, it's okay, but it's ugly. Here it's ugly, and here it's not perfect. It's not really smooth. So how I can improve this? How I can make it better, smoother? It's so simple. The only thing you have to do is to go to geometry nodes and only use two nodes. So let's go to geometry node, create a new profile. And the only thing we have to do is to add resample curve with this node, if we add it here, we are going to control how many points our curve have. As you can see, if I decrease this, we will have less or more. And now the important combo is to use set a spline type and select NURBS. This is going to convert the little segments in curve smoother. Look. And as you can see, look at the difference with these two nodes and without. So I'm going to disable before, as you can see, and after. And what you can do also is to decrease this number to make it smoother. Look, look, if I decrease the number, it's trying to make it more perfect. Of course, if you decrease this a lot, it will change a lot the pattern. But you get the idea, right? You can try to get a perfect number that your curve is perfectly smooth, as you can see. Look before, after, before, after. And you can try this with any design. So let's delete this again. And now I'm going to do, for example, with this. I'm going to try to do something like that, maybe, because I want, I don't know, to create a design or animate a camera. So I have this, and as you can see here, ah, looks ugly, looks not perfect. Of course, I can try to make it perfect, but the main point is that look before and now, if I activate this, after, before, after. And remember, I can change this to make it smoother. Look, before, after, before, after. Let's see it again with another example. And now I'm going to do, for example, let's try to do, I don't know, something like this. Going to make this. And let's see. I have this and now after. Okay, we need more points. But look the difference. Before, after, before, after. So remember, anytime that you want to improve a little bit your curve, just add these two notes. It's so simple. Nothing else. If you like this video, please give a like, subscribe, and see you in the next tutorial.